Welcome to Guido, your indoor navigation friend. Let's create a map. You create your account, create a place, and to start scanning the floor, you scan the image indicator. And then you start scanning the corners, like so. Then you scan obstacles. Obstacles are objects on your map that cannot be passed on foot. After that, you scan your placeholders. Placeholders are objects in your map that are points of interest, thing you want to go to in the future. And voila, you're done. Now, place administration. Here you can log into your account and see your maps, create QR codes for your maps, then edit your maps. By editing we mean you can click at your points of interests and edit them, like so. But that's not all, you can also create new points of interest in the browser and, like all other points of interest, give them a name and description. Looking at the edges, you can see lengths. These are the lengths of these edges. And we are proud to say that Guido is very precise in these measurements. Of course, no navigation is complete without a guide. In this menu, you can create yourself an agent by selecting a mesh and then painting on them however you like. And that mesh will be in your map. Yet another feature of Guido is indoor localization. Suppose someone is going around one of your maps. If you have your browser open, like so, you can see where they are going and what they are looking at. This is also a good showcase of Guido's live navigation service. Here you can see the 3D agent that you yourself have customized, guiding you to the objectives that you have asked for. When you arrive at your destination, you can also see the descriptions you have edited on the map. Mmm, and I was hungry too. Good thing I was using Guido.